from this lesson you can learn how to create a printable pdf dress pattern in adobe illustrator i'm going to click on the create a new button in order to create a new file and i will change the units to centimeters in the dialog as i will be drafting the pattern in centimeters i will specify a file size of 40 cm by 35 cm in height and width alternatively once you create the file you can click on the document setup button that you find in the options below the menu bar in this dialog you can set the units either to centimeters or inches now i will click on the line segment tool and click once on my artboard In the line segment tool options, I will set the length to 38 cm, which is the length of the center front seam in my basic front bodice block. I have selected an angle in this dialog that will result in a line that is vertical in direction. I am going to adjust the stroke weight of this line to 3. I will create a new line in horizontal direction. with the length equal to 23 cm this line is a squared line at the top of center front this is the shoulder level i will select this horizontal level with black arrow tool make a copy of this line and press enter in the move dialog i will give a value of 17 this value is the arm side depth i will choose to move this line vertically in a downward direction in this way i will create all the horizontal levels like shoulder slope level chest level bust level and waist level I will label all the levels with the text tool because I do not want to get confused with too many horizontal lines and levels. I will draw a short line at the beginning of the shoulder line. Select this with black arrow tool. Press enter and then Move the short line by 7.5 cm horizontally. This is the neck width point. Note that I am using short lines to mark all the growth points of the pattern. The way I am moving the short line according to a specified distance is so much similar to the way one would do in a software like Lectra Modaris which is meant for pattern drawing. In this way I will create the low shoulder point dark points etc for drafting instruction you can follow my video on how to draft the front bodice block now i will connect all these growth points to create the shape of the pattern i will move one more short line by 9 cm downward vertically on the center front line for neck depth i will now connect the low shoulder point to the underarm point passing through the point at the chest line using the pen tool all lines and curves can be reshaped using the white arrow tool i will connect low shoulder point to high point of shoulder with line segment tool i will use the arc tool to draw the neck line i will reshape the neck line using the direct selection tool also depending upon whether you are moving the line upward or downward left side or right side you will have to specify a negative value meaning a minus number or a positive value i will mark the legs of the bust and the waist dart using the line segment tool
I will draw a straight vertical line next to center front seam inside the pattern. In stroke panel, I will change the ends of this line to arrowhead shape so that it looks like the green line symbol. Once I am done with the pattern drawing, I will label the pattern properly using the text tool. I will save this file in PDF format. I can now print this anytime on paper using a large printer.